Hey y'all, we've got some green onions we're gonna talk about today. These are also called scallions. They are sometimes mistaken for spring onions and you can use them interchangeably if you like. Spring onions are a little bit more of a intense oniony flavor than these are. Your, the spring onion will have a more of a like onion bulb shape at the bottom. It won't just kind of be this straight like it does. Like this one actually almost starts to look like a spring onion, but it really gets more bulbous at the bottom like an actual onion bulb would look. Whereas this kind of straight one is more of that green onion or scallion look. Again, as I said, you can interchange them, but so these are gonna be called generally green onions or scallions, and uh, that's what we're gonna look at today. You, you, uh, spring onions do basically have the same prep as green onions, however, so that's nice. The easy thing we're gonna do is just start by you know taking that little root piece off, and you'll notice this one is relatively, you know, doesn't have any kind of nasty leaves on it. This one kind of has a little bit of, um, you know, this leaf or this uh, outer piece that's coming off. So we're just gonna remove that, just clean it up a little bit. Then what, you know, this is pretty much the prep you're gonna do for the most part. <laughs> this is gonna be it. You're just gonna slice or if I, or chop, whatever, whatever word it ends up getting used, this is typically how you prepare um, these green onions. So you just go up. And you can go up quite a ways. It's kind of your call how far you go up. It's gonna get a little bit tougher the higher up you go. Uh, but, you know, I like to go a little ways up. Actually, I might keep chopping these. I have this over here. It has a little bit more of kind of a leafy, earthy flavor the higher up you get. So, you know, that's really the most part all you need to do. If you wanted to, you could, of course, you know, chop it in smaller pieces if that the mood strikes you that way. But for the most part, whether it says chop or slice or something, this is really the preparation for um, for these onions. You know, in theory, you know, you might find a time that you would want to do kind of like you would a leek, where you cut it like that and then you just try and slice all the way down the middle. You could do that too, or take that and then cut it in half if you really needed to. But again, this is sort of the standard prep for these green onions. Okay, that's it for green onions.